trying to put Quebec in its place, and the place of Quebec is in Canada, nowhere else. The state has no place in the bedrooms of the nation. Living next to you is in some ways like sleeping with an elephant. What is the nature of your thoughts, gentlemen, when you say fuddle duddle or something like that? Why, um, why, why does everybody pick you for prime minister every time they, they, there's a vote? That's very hard to say. It's more important to keep law and order in this society than to uh, uh, be worried about uh, weak need people who uh, don't like the looks of, uh, of a at, at any family. cost? At any cost? How far would you go with that? How far would you extend that? Well, just watch me. In the course of the past 11 years, I've been, I've been given the greatest privilege that any Canadian can aspire to have. It's to serve at the head of this great party and to serve at the head of this great country, supported by the people that I have known. Well, welcome to the 1980s. These people in Quebec and in Canada want to split it up. They want to take it away from their children. They want to break it down. No, that's our answer. The greetings reflected the traditional relationship between the two countries. I love hecklers. I don't know about you, Mr. President. This could go on for a long while. I just might be roped into it. Uh, it wouldn't be my desire, mind you. I'm not anxious to fight another election, but uh, sometimes you can't resist a draft, can you? Why today, sir? Why today? Today, is a great snowstorm last night. Uh, the skies were right, went for a long walk, came back at midnight, took a sauna, got rid of all the, the uh, accumulation of baggage and uh, just made up my mind. <laughs>